<laughs> this is my marketing opportunity. <laughs> my own agent. My name is Shuti Gatwa and I am an actor. People might know me from a show on Netflix called Sex Education. A show about filleting bananas has sprung a whole bunch of careers. <laughs> I recently rapped on Barbie um, with Margot and Ryan and I am about to be the new doctor in Doctor Who. I definitely feel like I've gotten braver in my dress sense and in my styling. And Eric as a character has helped that. He's taught me that like closer to play with. My first significant purchase was a very bright red bum bag from Gucci. And I bought it after my first paycheck from Sex Education. So it was my first substantial paycheck that I had ever in my life. And I was going out to dinner, and I didn't have anything to wear. For some reason, I ended up on Bond Street. My ears started ringing, and I was like, I need, I need, I need it all, I need it all now. And I ended up leaving with this bum bag to go to dinner in, because you need a bum bag for dinner. It's color and vibrancy, I guess, is just what I was feeling at that time. So it just reminds me of that time of just like, excitement and joy. So the last piece that I bought on Outnet was uh, an Eero bomber jacket. Cream and fabulous. The quality of it just felt strong <laughs> and sturdy. <laughs> and yet like, but it was like very cool and casual. So my last piece, my everything piece, is a piece of Rwandan artwork that I stole from my mum's house. I think it was when I was moving down to London at 21, I just like took it and put it in my bag so that I can have a little piece of home or wherever I go, as cheesy as that sounds. And it just reminds me to be grateful as well. It just says thank you and it's just it's good to always practice gratitude. My mom does not know that I stole the artwork. So I'm sorry, mom. I'm very, very sorry. This is my confessional. But thank you. <laughs> my gratitude, but thank you. Thank you, Mum. This was my first last in everything with the Outnet. Thank you for watching.